Good afternoon, Araneta. Good afternoon, Almo. Magandang hapon po sa inyong lahat. And you are here and watching Ginoo at Binibining Socorro 2019, the pre-pageant. Well, be captivated for the spectacular upcycle, recycled national costume of our Ginoo at Binibining Socorro candidates because they are not just have this beauty, the intelligence, but they also want to promote, of course, saving our Mother Earth. And again, after the national costume, we'll actually take place with our talent competition wherein, let's see who among them can really, can really dance, can really sing, and some of them might actually deliver us some heartbroken poems or be in love with their poems. So, without further ado, I would like also to, of course, we are grateful for the presence of our dear Kagawad, Kagawad Leo, Men uh, Leo Mendoza, Honorable Kagawad Cesar Shoson, Kagawad Cesar Shosan is actually the chairman committee of the religious affairs and uh, religious sector and cultural affairs. He is also actually the chairman of this pageant. And of course, of course, Honorable Kagawad Pamela Galang, Honorable Kagawad Ray Bartolai, and of course our OLPH Paris Cubao representative, Miss Gloria Kitikit. Mamaya. Dadating pa yung ating mga special na bisita. Okay. These are the people, or this is actually the group of people who will have a hard time to choose who will be our best in national costume and our best in talent. Our first judge, she earned her master's degree in education at the Ate Ateneo de Manila University, a retired school principal for from the Division of City Schools of Quezon City. Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Escarlita P. Bandong. Our second judge is the product specialist of Vivo Mobile Tech. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Eric Sevalia. And our last judge is actually a former Miss Kawayan City Isabella, a recipient of Most Outstanding Teacher by Various Organizations in the Philippines a retired school teacher. Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Leticia Evangelista Mary. We have the following criteria for judging for the best in national costume. Originality or cultural relevance, four points. Resourcefulness and innovation, including futuristic presentation. 50 to 100% materials use and durability, is another three points. Execution and overall impact. Manner of presentation, poise and beauty is another three points for a total of 10 points. So one is the, the lowest, 10 is the highest. So ladies and gentlemen, I don't want to keep you waiting because I know that you've been here since one o'clock, two o'clock in the afternoon. Oh, okay. <laughs> and I would like to acknowledge the presence of Honorable Kagawad Alfredo Navarra. Thank you for coming, sir. Going back, please all welcome the Ginoo at Binibining Socorro 2019 in their national costume. To start with, our first batch of candidates. Candidate number one. He is wearing an inspired Pahiyas festival costume from Lukban Quezon. It is made of, of keeping, used as festival decorations. He added banik, abaka, old cardboards, nets to highlight this colorful theme costume. Ladies and gentlemen, that's candidate number one. The Pahiyas festival representing Pamayanang del Carmen from the home of keeping in the Payas Festival, Lukban Quezon. Candidate number two.
Candidate number two, use a material from old spoons, rubber mat, and fabric. Ladies and gentlemen, that's candidate number two. Maayong hapon sa iyong tanan. My name is David Smil Hernandez, 19, from the oldest province of the Philippines, Aklan! Representing Pamayanang de la Paz. Candidate number three. Candidate number three, the finest Filipiniana fabric and well-detailed embroidery can be found in this region. The costume is made of sugar sack, old lace from an old skirt, accentuated with rhinestones from an old garment, and a trash bag. Ladies and gentlemen, candidate number three. Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Juan Gabriel Miguel, 17, from the finest embroidery barong, Lumban, Laguna, and representing Pamenang Asuncion. Let's bring back our first set of candidates in their national costume. Pamayanang del Carmen, Aaron Homer Giochino. Pamayanang de la Paz, Davis Hill Hernandez. And Pamayanang Asuncion, Juan Gabriel Miguel. Let's welcome our second batch of candidates for Ginoso Color 2019 National Costume. Candidate number four. The costume depicts the hard-working farmers in the Philippines. It's made from disposable spoons, salakot, battle crowns, rubber mat, chicken feathers, and old bagong. Ladies and gentlemen, candidate number four. Maayong ugtu po kaya ko ngan. My name is John Carlo Cruz Mejia, 25, representing from the land of the melting pot of the Philippines, Tarlac City. And I am the pride of Pamayanang Imakulada. Candidate number five. The Ibaloy or Nabaloy are a subgroup of the Igorot. The Ibaloy are mostly an agricultural people who cultivate rice in terrace fields. The costume was made out of scrap materials like old telephone directory, used fabrics, old wooden chair, birds of paradise, and an old monopad. Ladies and gentlemen, that's candidate number five. Don Carlo Batay, 19, where the god of an epic Bicolanos, Ibaloy of Bicol region, representing Pamenang Lenaval. Candidate number six. Before the colonization, Philippines is already rich in culture and tradition. Men are admired for being powerful with strength and knowledge to lead a certain community. The costume is inspired from the islands of Visayas. It is made of an excess fabric, a baka, rattan, and an old electronic wiring. Ladies and gentlemen, candidate number six. Arvin Evangelista, 27, from the Queen City of South, Cebu City, representing Pamenang Guadalupe. Let's all bring back our second batch of candidates for Ginoong Socorro 2019 National Costume. From Pamayanang Imaculada, John Carlo Mejia. Pamayanang Lenaval, Don Carlo Abatay. Pamayanang Guadalupe, Arvin Lumahin Evangelista. Let's welcome 
Binibining Socorro 2019 in their national costume. Our first batch of candidate is candidate number one. Her costume is made out of banik and kacha, accentuated with walis tambo, feathers, old tablecloth, used curtain, and suman wrappers. The headdress was simplified by plastic spoons, abaka, chicken feathers, and walis tambo. This costume was inspired by the artistic imagery of the Ilocos region, the province of the native handicrafts and root crops. Ladies and gentlemen, candidate number one. Magandang hapon sa inyong lahat. I am Jenica Verza, 21 years old, representing Pamayanang Peña Francia from the land of Banigs and root crops, Ilocos! Candidate number two. Her costume is made out of used rice sacks and different colors of plastic. The fan is from an old illustration board, used spoons, and battle cup. It is inspired from the Philippine flag. It is Doman candidate number two. Candidate number three. Her costume is artistically made from plastic bottles, cups, and old baskets. Inspired by red hot peppers or sealy, which the Bicol region is more popularly known. Ladies and gentlemen, candidate number three. Let's bring back our first batch of candidates from candidate number one to three. Pamayanang Peña Francia, Jenica Verso. Pamayanang Guadalupe, Tiffany Dorado. And Pamayanang Lourdes, April Seya. She is wearing a Maranao Princess of Mindanao. Her costume is made from sack of rice and plastic bags. The headdress and the accessories are made from broken electric fans. This costume symbolizes the Philippine flag. Ladies and gentlemen, candidate number four. Maika Timbresa, 21, from Pamayanang Asuncion, Maranao Princess of Mindanao. Candidate number five. Woo! Candidate number five. Her costume is made from used rattan baskets, rubber mat, and used slippers with a combination of fishnet and some used curtains. They added some colors like gold, brown, beige, and black for an ethnic glamour. Ladies and gentlemen, that's candidate number five. Good afternoon everyone, I am Francesca Nicole Wenceslao, 20, from the land where the major cut flowers producer in the country and also the biggest exporter of tropical fruits in the Philippines, Davao City! <laughs> Representing Pamayanang Fatima! Candidate number six. <laughs> Candidate number six costume is made of handmade and created by Cristina Zamora Adeser. The gown is made out of rice sacks, which represent Tarlac City, one of the biggest producers from, for rice in the Philippines. The painting in the middle is the Nativity of Jesus, and Tarlac City is also popular as the Belen capital of the Philippines. The headdress is made out of plastic flowers and uses styrofoam, while the earrings is made out of bottle crowns. The painted hands below the gown represents her student, that inspires her throughout her journey. Ladies and gentlemen, candidate number six. 
Maya Puktu Kekongan. My name is Monique Adisar, 21 from Pamayanang Imaculada, representing the Belen capital of the Philippines, Tarlac City. Let's bring back our candidate, a second batch of candidates for Binibini Socorro National Costume. Pamayanang Asunson, Maika Timbresa. Pamayanang Fatima, Francesca Nicole Wenceslao. And Pamayanang Imaculada, Monique Abiser. Our last batch of candidates for Binibining Socorro 2019 National Costume Category. Candidate number seven. Inspired by the Panambenga Festival of Baguio City, which celebrates in the month of February to March, the costume is made out of rice socks and old clothes. It is designed with vibrant flowers, which symbolizes the festival's icon, meaning the season of blooming. Ladies and gentlemen, candidate number seven. Sean Denise Juanino, 17, inspired by the season of blooming by the Bea Festival of Baguio City. Candidate number eight. Candidate number eight. The Panagyaman Festival is the success of rice production and harvest in the month of April that provides substance and significance to the colorful, lively spirit festivals held across the Philippines, which happens in the month of May and June. The national costume is made out of rice socks that symbolizes the sturdy, passionate, and the termin of the hardworking farmers. Ladies and gentlemen, candidate number eight. Magandang araw sa inyong lahat. Ako po pala si Danica Mave M. Cachero representing Panagyaman Festival from Pamayanan del Carmen! Candidate number nine. Candidate number nine is wearing a Dinagyang Festival costume. The festival celebrated by the Iluenos, her costume is made of yellow pages, straws, paper plates, rice sack, kacha, hula hoop, plastic bag, plastic bottle, walis tambo, plastic spoons, cartons, paint, wood, and bottle cups. Ladies and gentlemen, that's candidate number nine. Last batch of candidates for Binibining Socorro 2019 Best in National Costume. Candidate number seven, Pamayanang Lenabal. Denise Juanino, Pamayanang Del Carmen, Danica May Cachero, and Pamayanang De La Paz, Charlotte Tuman. There you go, ladies and gentlemen, our Ginoo at Binibining Socorro 2019 in their national costume. Aren't they spectacular, right? Do you agree with me? Have you been amazed? Have you been captured? Captivated? 
there will be more at stake as we go on with our talent competition later. Diba? Kailangan mabitin eh. Diba? Are you enjoying? People from third floor, I know you're busy getting your passports. <laughs> Second floor, are you enjoying? How about your first floor? Okay. So, meron na kayong mga bet na candidates? I can hear you. Meron na? Meron. So, hopefully, ah, bukas bumalik din kayo. Okay? For we will be having our next batch of candidates vying for the title of Manny Queen 2019. Okay. So, Manny Queen 2019 is actually the Barangay Teen Pageant with a Cause. The meaning of Manny Queen is man is unique to be a queen. Because this June, we are actually celebrating the Pride Month here in the Philippines. Back home in, in Canada, we are also starting our Pride Month in June, but that's actually in Toronto. And in Vancouver, where I am actually, where I live, we actually celebrate the Pride Month uh, first week of August or the first Sunday of August. Okay. And of course, we would like to acknowledge the presence of our dear Barangay Chairman, Honorable Dr. Teodolo O. Santos. Together with our Honorable Kagawad Engelbert Bangal. Well, Jay, take it away. One Fiesta 2019 would like to thank the following sponsors. Dr. Teodolo O. Santos Punong Barangay and Council, Araneta Center, Ali Mall, St. Therese School of Technology, Vivo Mobile Tech, Slimmer's World, Mayor Joy Belmonte of Quezon City, Councilor Franz Bumaran of the 3rd District of QZ, San Miguel Corporation, Urban Smiles Dental Clinic, LSA Aesthetic Plastic Surgery Clinic, Vast Aqua Care Center, Debbie's Kitchen, Rebisco, Art in Island, Stardust Photography Philippines, Cadena Press Foundation, People League Philippines, AIM Global Incorporation, Miss Agnes Galapia, Beauty Zone Facial and Spa, Lily Mar Beauty Salon, Camarilla Elementary School, and One Delicious Dinner. And of course, we would like to thank Slimmer's World. Slimmer's World, the ultimate in slimming, health, fitness, and beauty. It is opening new branch located at the lower ground of Alimo, over there. Kawai po sa Slimmer's World, hello! And thank you, thank you for gracing our event for today and for the whole month of June. Avail their products and at the same time their services, free figure consultation, free skin analysis with a 65% off for pre-selling price and also they're having a free aerobics classes, Zumba and, Aer and Aero. Register at the Slimmer's World booth located at the Lower Ground Alley Mall over there where you can actually see those ladies and those um, handsome gentlemen wearing blue and white t-shirts. So they're having um, Zumba on June 21st, 28th and 30, and July 5th and July 12th. And aerobics class on June 22 and July 20. And every schedule, there will be a raffle draw. So what are you waiting for? Register to Slimmer's World because you'll never know. Please be fit. Stay healthy. So you can actually have that young, beautiful you. Okay, we would like to acknowledge the presence of the SK uh, Sangguniang Kabataan ng Barangay Socorro. Thank you for coming. And of course, we are inviting all of you on June 22, Saturday at 8 o'clock to 12 o'clock noon, the Kalinga sa Parokya, wherein we will be having our medical and dental mission at Our Lady of Perpetual Health Parish Ground. And also, on June 22 to 23, that's Saturday and Sunday, 
from 8 o'clock to 12 noon, we'll have a job fair at Our Lady of Perpetual Health Parish. So yung mga naghahanap po ng trabaho dyan, magkakaroon po tayo ng job fair sa atin pong simbahan na located po dyan sa may 13th Avenue. On June 22 at 7 o'clock in the evening, we will be crowning the Mani Queen 2019 Barangay Teen Pageant with a cost at Barangay Socorro Covered Court that will be in front of Camp Aguinaldo Gate 1. On June 23, there will be a Tianggian at 7 o'clock in the morning to 9 o'clock in the evening at Our Lady of Perpetual Help Parish. On June 23, on same day from 9 o'clock a.m. onwards, we will be having the Battle of the Stars at Pumarens Cup All-Star. Ayan po yung mga dating nanalo sa Pumarens Cup before na magtitipon-tipon po para sa ating ikagaganda ng ating piyesta at magkakaon po sila ng exhibition game. Right? That will be at 9 o'clock onwards at Barangay Socorro Covered Court. On June 28, Friday, it will be our Pasik Laban 2019, a glitz and glamour of their yesteryears. So ito po yung mga Senior Citizens Talent Competition that will be uh, at 7 o'clock to 9 o'clock in the evening at Our Lady of Perpetual Health Parish Ground. And of course, on June 29, Saturday, the most awaited after 25 years of waiting, we will be crowning the new Ginoo at Binibining Socorro 2019 Barangay Idols of the New Millennium. So that will be at 7 o'clock in the evening at Barangay Socorro Covered Court in front of Camp Aguinaldo Gate 1. So hopefully you will not forget those events, ha? At meron pa! Ganun talaga kasipag ang ating Barangay Council at ang ating simbahan dahil gustong gusto nating makapagpasaya ng maraming tao. One Fiesta 2019 on June 30th. So we'll be having a grand parade in the morning. That will start at 8 o'clock. And then we'll have the Bancheto that will run from 8 o'clock to 9 o'clock in the evening from at, at Our Lady of Perpetual Health Parish. And of course, the celebrated Mass by Bishop at 10.30 in the morning to 11.30. And the Palagong Pinoy uh, from 1 o'clock to 3 o'clock in the afternoon at Our Lady of Perpetual Health. And I would like to take the opportunity to thank, of course, the committees and the organization that actually made this event possible. One Fiesta organizing team headed by, of course, Barangay Chairman Honorable Doc Teodolo O. Santos, Honorable Kagawad Cesar, uh, Cesar Siosan, Committee Chairman Religious, Affairs, uh, Religious and Cultural Affairs, of course, yours truly as the overall director and coordinator, Abigail Bravo, Barangay Socorro event organizer, Miss Lolit C, Nazareth Riola, Daniel Sabalie, Daniela Gallardo, April Lescano, Charmaine Adeser, Roy Tamayo, Jerickson Agunas, Gloria Kitikit, Ed Caballo, Christina Cortez, Donna Cachero, Tina Papi, and of course, we would like to thank the Our Lady of Perpetual Health Parish Youth Ministry, Our Lady of Perpetual Health Parish Cubao, the Sangguni Ang Kabataan ng Barangay Socorro, Barangay Socorro Admin Office, headed by Mr. Jester Masenas and his team, Barangay Socorro Pride Council, Barangay Socorro Senior Citizens Office, Barangay Development Officer, headed by Mr. Ray Kabugnason and the maintenance team, Echo Aid, headed by Ms. Ann Partoriza and her team, BPSO headed by Mr. Butch Pineda and his team. Traffic Enforcement team headed by Mr. Carmelo Abadilla. And, so sa inyo pong lahat, maraming, maraming, maraming salamat po. This is actually the start. So last July 16, we had our Parade of Beauties. Successful naman po. Ngayon naman po, itong ating free pageant. So, hanggang sa June 30 po, magsasama-sama po tayong lahat para po magkaroon ng isang maayos at maunlad na fiesta para po sa ating patron na Our Lady of Perpetual Health and of course, para sa ating constituents ng Barangay Socorro. So girls, would you like to actually invite all our audience? 
Yeah, good afternoon, Ali Mall. Hi, everyone. We would like to invite you all for our up upcoming free pageant competition that will be held the same place tomorrow, 4 p.m., Miss Manny Queen 2019. Hello, po, I'm Rad RG, 19 years old from Pamayana, Asuncion. Dan Valdez Tabula po, of course, supportahan niyo po yung aming coronation night on June 22nd sa ating barangay court sa harap ng Camp Aguinaldo. Um, my name is Juliana May Sacramento from Pamayanang Imaculada. Um, sana supportahan niyo po kami sa darating na coronation night sa June 22 sa barangay Socorro Covered Court. Tapat po siya ng Camp Aguinaldo Gate 1. And of course, this is brought to, um, presented by, uh, by our Puno ka, punong barangay, Doc Ted Santos and Council. And of course, um, supportahin niyo po ulit ang aming binuo at binibini Socorro sa darating na 29. At sana po ganito karami po ang pumunta. Maraming salamat po! In the cooperation of Our Lady of Perpetual Health, uh, celebrating their 50th, 55th founding anniversary. I'm Kat, and I'm 18 years old, and I'm from Pamayanang, Guadalupe. Thank you so much. So ladies and gentlemen, once again, our official candidates for Manny Queen 2019. So tomorrow, there will be their pre, um, they will actually be having their pre-pageant here in the same place, same stage, at 4 o'clock in the afternoon. So handa na kayo for your national costume and for your talent competition tomorrow. Huh? Kinakabahan. Talagang kinakabahan? Oh, hef, hef, hooray na lang tayo. <laughs> so thank you, ladies. You may now enjoy again. Take your seat and enjoy the beauty and glamour and the handsomeness of our Ginoo at Binibining Sokoa 2019. Diba? Ang gaganda, sa sexy. Nainggit nga po si Abby. We saw ni Abby ganyan siya katangkad. <laughs> okay. So, I'm sure you're all excited for the talent competition. Our criteria for judging. Okay? So, for the Ginoo at Binibining Sokoro 2019, we will actually be selecting the top three finalists. Okay? So, this top three finalists will be performing once again on the coronation night. And we will determine who will be our Ginoo at Binibining Socorro 2019 Best in Talent. Good afternoon po everyone. Uh, I'm Aaron Homer P. Joquino and I'll be singing... Um, I'll, be si I'll be singing my, my original composition entitled Angel Ko. Napatigil ako nung makita kita Tibok ng puso'y di mapigilan Unang beses na naramdaman Ibig ko ay may daladalang ka ba Sa mga kilos mo'y napatigil Sadyang natutulad na At unti-unti bumabagal ang oras Liwanag ng iyong ipi Ang aking naikita At unti-unti Tumitigil ang oras sa yung mga matang gaigang pala sa ganda. Oh, pwede bang malaman ng pangalan mo? Promise, hindi ako manggugulo. Gusto ko nang makilala ang anghel na biyaya ng lahit sa mundo. Whoa, whoa. Siguro ngay hindi mo napansin Lumiwanag ang lahat ng ibang tumati Hindi ko na alam ang gagawin Ang aking damdamin na isang sambitin At unti-unti Bumabagan ang oras, liwanag ng iyong ngiti Ang aking naikita at unti-unti Tumitigil ang oras sa iyong mga matang daigang tala sa ganda Oh, 
Pwede bang malaman ang pangalan mo? Ramis, hindi ako manggugulo Gusto ko lang makilala ang anghel Na bihaya ng langit sa mundo Oh, oh, oh Oh, pwede bang malaman ang pangalan mo? Promise, hindi ako manggugulo Gusto ko nang makilala ang anghel Na bihaya ng langit sa mundo Oh, oh, oh Ikaw ang natatanging anghel ko Once again, put your hands for pam pam ah pamayan ng delapas Davis Mill Hernandez. Once again, from Pamayan de la Paz, Davis Mill Hernandez.
mamaya ng asusunsyon, Juan Gabriel Miguel. Obat mo ketang sabadu, di pasyal ku keta kekayu. Inyang abat cawan mo ku, pepatagal mo kong asu. Obat mo ketang sabadu, di pasyal ku keta kekayu. Inyang abat cawan mo ku, pepatagal mo kong asu. Thank you, Pampamaya ng Immaculada, John Carlo Mejia. Certificate of Appreciation to Ali Mall for invaluable contribution as one of our major sponsors for Ginoo at Binibing Socorro 2019, the Barangay Adults of the New Millennium, and Manny Queen 2019 pageant, Barangay Teen pageant with a cause in celebration of the 55th Feast of Our Lady of Perpetual Health with the team Juan Quiesa 2019, Maria, Ilo ng Pamilya, Kaagapay sa Pagpapatatag ng Simbahan. Given this 19th day of June in the year of our Lord, 2019, signed by yours truly, and at the same time, Barangay Event Organizer Abigail Bravo, Committee Chairman, Religious Sector and Cultural Affairs, Honorable Kagawad Cesar Shoson, and of course, our Barangay Socorro Chairman, Honorable Chedolo O. Santos. So please, Mama Angelica, thank you so much. And at the same time, we would love to actually also give you in behalf of um, Barangay Council and at the same time oh, LPH from Araneta Center. Eh, to Araneta Center also, ma'am. Thank you once again, ma'am Angelica. <laughs> You give this up to me, give it all, oh, I just want to see, I just want to see how beautiful you are, you know that I see it, I know you're the star, 
Where you go, we'll follow, no matter how far. If life is a movie, then you're the best part. Oh, oh, oh you're the best part. Oh, oh, oh. It's the sunrise and those brown eyes. You're the one that I desire. When we wake up, then we make love. Makes me feel so nice. You're my water when I'm stuck in the desert. You're my talent that I take when I head hurts. You're the sunshine of my life. I just want to see how beautiful you are. You know that I see it. I know you're the star. Where you go, I follow, no matter how far. If life is a movie, then you're the best part. You're the best part. Oh, oh, oh. Thank you, thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, once again, Pampamayan ng Lenaval, Don Carlo Abatay. Ya 
Jenica Verso. Segundo at minuto. Araw at linggo. Milyon-milyong tao at ako'y naririto. Minsan nang nagmasid sa mundo. Mundo kay rami ng pinagbago. Lalo na sa kabataan. Kabataan na sinasabing pag-asa ng bayan. Iba ang nakasanayan. Di pag-aaral ang tinututukan. Kundi sa murang edad, relasyon ang ipinaglalaban. Kinain ng sistema. Iba't ibang uso, sinasabayan ng bawat isa, makalimutan ang dignidad. Noon at ngayon, malayo ang pagkakatulad. Barkada ang naging libangan. Pag Diyos pinag-uusapan, halos lahat kinagyatalikuran, mata ay nasa social media. Nakalimutan ang mga yubilo sa kanilang pamilya. Mundong di na hawak ang libro ko, di na sa kamay ang iba't ibang bisyo, di na habayin na lang tinitignan pinagbabasihan. Mundong kahirami ng pinagbago at ako'y naririto. Isang kabataan rin. Sinusubo kang ganyaki. Ganyaki na kaisipan ng kabataan na kinain ang sistema ng mundong niikutan. Sana bawat isa sa atin alamin. Alamin ko ano ang dapat unahin. Pamilya ba o social media? Pag-aaral o bisyo ang ipairal? Relasyon sa mundo o relasyon kay sa Kristo. Tama o mali. Ang desisyon ay nasa kaisipan lamang ng kabataan. Ngunit para sa akin, bigyang halaga ang tamang daan. Subukang isipin ang nakabubuti. Dahil alam natin lahat na masaya ngayon. Pero nasa huli ang pagsisi. Maraming salamat po. Pampamayan ng Guadalupe, Tiffany Dorado.
Thank you. Pampame ng Lourdes April Saya. Unang araw, pagpasok niya ng pintuan, iba'y nararamdaman ko. Bakit sobrang saya ko na kinakabahan? Pero isa lang yung nasabi ko, Lord, siya na ba yung pinakahinihintay ko? Hanggang sa nagkabalagayan ng loob, nagkakwentuhan, at pinakamasaya yung nasa jeep kami, bumubuo kami ng mga salita sa plate number. Grabe, di ba? Sobrang saya. Pag malungkot siya, malungkot ako. Pag masaya siya, masaya ako. Pero, hindi pala ako yung mahal niya. May mahal pala siyang iba. At hindi ako yun. Sana bukas, sana bukas tama na lahat. Sana bukas maging maayos na lahat. Tama at oras na kami ay nagkita. At hindi na mali ang bukas namin. Kahirap pala umibig sa dikamang panahon. Kung bakit may kulang natapuan ang isang tulad mo. Sana noon pa kita nakilala Sana noon pa lang na ang puso kong ito ay malayang pangmahal Bukas na lang kita mamahalin Sabay sa paraya ng ating mga puso. Bukas na lang kita. Bukas na lang kita. Bukas na lang kita. Breaking our heart with bukas na lang kita mamahalin.
wouldn't be a drag, just be a queen. Whether you're broke or ever be. You're black, but they chill and say, you're Lebanese, you're Ori. Said they're like, it's a little bitch, you want to come to me. You're going to love you, said you're going to say, Once again, from Pamayanang Fatima, Francesca Nicole Wenceslao. Pamaya ng Imakulada, Monique Adeser.
Pampamayang in the ball, Miss Denise Juanino. Danica made Cacero. Charlotte Tomale. 
request Mr. Sevalla to actually receive our certificate and token of appreciation. So a project of Barangay Socorro Chairman Teodolo O. Santos, MD and Council in cooperation with Our Lady of Perpetual Health Parish Cubao present this certificate of appreciation to Mr. Joseph Giabao for his invaluable contribution as one of the member of the pre-pageant panel of judges during the Ginoo at Binibining Socorro 2019 pageant, the Barangay Idols of the New Millennium, in celebration of the 55th Feast of Our Lady of Perpetual Health with the theme, One Piesa 2019, Maria Ilaw ng Pamilya Kaagapay sa Pagpapatatag ng Simbahan. Given this 19th day of June in the year of our Lord, 2019, signed by yours truly, together with Miss Abigail Bravo, our Barangay Event Organizer. Miss Abby, please come on stage. Uh, and Honorable Kagawad Cesar M. Shoson, Chairman Committee, Religious Sector and Cultural Affairs. And of course, Barangay Socorro Chairman, Dr. Teodolo O. Santos, MD. So thank you, sir. So please extend our regards and thanksgiving to Mr. Joseph Diabao for gracing this event also. Actually, Vivo, Vivo Mobile Tech is our major, is one of our major sponsors with our Parade of Beauties and also for doing our stage design. So are you ready? May I call on once again? Our Gino Socorro 2019 candidates, Pampamayanang del Carmen, Aaron Homer Jokino, Pampamayanang de la Paz, Davis Hill Hernandez, Pampamayanang Asuncion, Juan Gabriel Miguel, Pampamayanang Imaculada, John Carlo Mejia, Pampamayanang Lenaval, Don Carlo Abatay, Pampamayanang Guadalupe, Arvin Lumahin Evangelista, our Binibining Socorro 2019 candidates, Pampamayanang Peña Francia, Jenica Verso. Pampamayanang Guadalupe, Tiffany Dorado. Pampamayanang Lourdes, April Seya. Pampamayanang Asuncion, Maika Timbreza. Pampamayanang Fatima, Francesca Nicole Wenceslao. Pampamayanang Imaculada, Monique Adeser. Pampamayanang Lanaval, Denise Juanino. Pampamayanang Del Carmen, Danica Maeve Cachero. And Pampamayanang De La Paz, Charlotte Tomale. Okay. So, dito ako. Ayan. So, are we ready? So, once again, Slimmer's World, the ultimate in slimming health, fitness, and beauty, is opening new branch located at the Lower Ground Alimo. Avail of the following. Free figure consultation. Free skin analysis. 65% off free selling price. And free aerobics classes for Zumba and aerobics. That is actually scheduled on. For Zumba is on June 21st, 28th and 30th. And July 5th and July 12th. And for aerobics is on June 22nd and July 20th. Every schedule, there will be a raffle. So what are you waiting for? Register at the Slimmer's World booth located at the Lower Ground Alley Mall. So are we ready? Once again, okay? I'll be calling our top three finalists for the talent competition. And they will be performing once again on the coronation night of the Ginoo at Binibining Socorro 2019 that will take place on June 29, 2019, that Saturday at the Barangay Socorro Covered Court in front of Camp Aguinaldo Gate 1. Once again, we would like to invite you tomorrow for our Mannequin 2019 
the pre-pageant, okay? That will be at 4 o'clock in the afternoon. Same stage, same place, Alimo Activity Center. Once again, we would like to thank the Alimo Management, headed by, of course, Miss Angelica Salvador, the mar Marketing Officer of Alimo. Thank you for making this free pageant possible for the first ever, actually. Honestly speaking, I am proud to say that for the 55th year of celebrating the Our Lady of Perpetual Health Fiesta, this is the very first time that Ginoo at Binibining Socorro was held here in Alimo Activity Center. And I am proud of my team and I am proud of the Barangay Socorro Council for really trusting us to make all the events possible. And of course, we would like to thank again Miss Judy Araneta for allowing us for the Parade of Beauties last Sunday. It was really very successful. Thank you for allowing us, Ma'am Judy. And alam kong hindi ka nagsasawa para po kay para po sa ating uh, Our Lady of uh, per, uh, Perpetual Health. Nandyan po kayo para lang tumulong. At para po sa ating Barangay Socorro, nandyan po kayo lagi na nakaagapay para po sa ikagaganda ng ating po mga events. Are you ready? I'll be here at your back. Okay. Ladies, would you mind to actually move backwards, please? Ladies, move backwards. Yan. For I am going to announce our top three finalists for the talent competition of Binoo at Binibining Socorro 2019. I will announce the finalists in random order. Ginoong Socorro 2019 talent. First finalist goes to Pamayanang Imakulada Mr. John Carlo Mejia Second finalist Ginoong Socorro 2019 Talent From Pamayanang de la Paz, Mr. Davis. 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 Okay. Thank you for correcting me. Mr. Davis Hernandez. And to complete our top three finalists for Ginoong Socorro Talent, please welcome to complete our top three from Pamayanang Asuncion, Juan Miguel Gabriel. Yan. Juan Gabriel. Juan Gabriel Miguel. <laughs> Pareho kasi yung pangalan. Yun. Okay, guys, would you mind to move on the side, please? Okay. Binibining Socorro 2019 First finalist for talent
from Bamayanang Asuncion, Maika Timbreza. Our second finalist for Binibining Socorro 2019 Talent. From Pamayanang Fatima, Francesca Nicole Wenceslao. complete our top three finalists for Binibining Socorro 2019 Talent. From Pamayanang Immaculada, Monique Adeser. There you go, ladies and gentlemen, our top three finalists for Ginoo at Binibining Socorro 2019 talent. Okay, ah. Ay, ay. Once again, ah, I would like to make things clear. They are not top three finalists for the crown. They are top three finalists for the talent competition. They will be performing once again the same talent on the coronation night which will take place on June 29, 2019. So once again, Dr. Ed, come here. Kita kita jan. <laughs> and of course, we would like to invite our three judges to join. Everybody, please, Kagawads, the council, the SK, please, the judges, please, to join our candidates. Okay, guys, please compress. DC and Arvin and Aaron, please on stage for our photo op. Once again, this is Maven Gutierrez Hauser greeting you. A pleasant evening. Buenas noches. And see you all tomorrow for the Manic Queen 2019 pre-pageant competition. Thank you and good night. God bless you all.